Frogs are the easiest hunt for some predators, but most of the time, feeding upon a frog is the worst mistake they can make. Today, we will be looking at several predators feeding upon frogs and bringing them to their platter. You'll even witness a poisonous frog killing a large crocodile. So, without any further ado, let's get started. A Leopard Frog By its name, you would say that it has qualities like a leopard and can run up to 58 km per hour. But no, that is not the case. It's called a leopard frog because it has dots on its body just like a leopard has. Anyway, let's see this frog getting eaten. A snake decided to feast on it. It sneaks up on it and attacks this giant frog by eating its rear legs. The frog started making noise, but there was nothing it could do now but just experience being eaten alive. The snake takes it to the bottom real slow. It steadily feeds on it by taking one step at a time. When it reached its head, the snake suffered a little because the frog wasn't giving in, and there was no extra space for the front legs to fit in. But soon the giant frog was inside the snake's belly. And if you're wondering, a leopard frog is not poisonous, so the snake was just okay while the frog was chilling inside it. In this case, a frog isn't feeding on a beetle, but a beetle is feeding upon a frog. So, what is the name of this legendary beetle? They are called Epimus beetles. Hunting frogs is their everyday life. In this video, two beetles are feeding upon a frog, so let's have a look. The Epimus beetle is running after a frog while the frog is trying hard to get away. But after getting a little far, it drops all the defenses. The beetle comes and attacks its belly. The frog tries hard to defend itself. It crawls around, jumps around, and tries to get it away with its little feet, but nothing is working. The beetle moves to its back and starts eating it there. The Epimus beetle knows the strength and weaknesses of frogs. They know that by attacking at a specific point on the back, they can easily disable its nervous system. And it succeeded in doing that. Soon other beetles arrive and continue the lunch. Most of the time, eating a frog can be your worst idea even if you are starving to death in a forest all lost. It's because you wouldn't know if a frog is safe to eat or not. Just like this red-backed poison frog. A snake in a container was allied with poisonous frogs, but it decided to feed on them. It attacked a red poisonous frog. It tried to swallow it whole, but was unsuccessful. After a while, the frog struggled a bit, but the snake doesn't let it go. It feeds upon it. But what happened afterward is hilarious. The snake felt like its world was upside down. The poison it swallowed started its effect. Little did it know that it will last only 20 minutes if it's lucky. If that is not the case, the snake will be dead in 5 minutes. This is why you should avoid frogs at all cost. Even playing with a frog and toad is not always healthy. It can have severe side effects, so it is better to stay safe. A big frog, a small snake. Snakes are known for feeding upon animals that are bigger in size. The same is with this one. The snake here is quite small compared to the size of the frog it is feeding on. It sneaked up and attacked it from the back. When its whole leg was inside the snake's body, it started to move and save its skin. But it was too late then. There was no way it could break free from the grip of the snake. It took the snake 7 minutes to completely swallow the frog. You'd be surprised to see that at the end of the feast, a whole big frog was fit inside a thin snake. Not to mention they can sometimes eat each other. The guy recording the scene be like, Hey, it's not the best to disturb nature. Fire ants are extremely dangerous if they travel in a herd, and their favorite food is eating frogs alive. When a large group of ants decides to feed on animals, it won't stop until the job is done. Another thing is that it is very hard to get them off you if you don't have arms. Hundreds of fire ants decided to attack a frog. Just like you would have noticed up to this point is that the frog's defensive maneuvers are the worst. When they are getting eaten, they will just stand still and do nothing. They won't even try jumping around until it is too late. When the frog decided to freeze time, it made the work of the fire ants even easier. After 36 hours of ant attacks, there was nothing but bones left. It's funny to say that frogs aren't even safe from small insects like ants. There are times when eating a frog becomes the worst nightmare for the predators. Like I said, 
feeding on a frog is the worst mistake the predators ever make. This toad is called sugarcane toad. It is plump, ugly, and poisonous. Its poison is extremely lethal and can kill predators like snakes, crocodiles, and other animals that dare to eat it. But hey, let's make a crocodile eat it. This croc dared to eat this toad. It considered it an easy meal, but little did it know that eating this toad will cost his life. The croc was then found dead floating on the water. When the cause of death was investigated, its stomach was filled with a milky white toxin that is found on these toads. The crocs feeding on sugarcane toads are common in Australia, but do you know who is responsible for that? It is the government of Australia. These toads were introduced in 1935, thinking they would help the sugarcane by eating the beetles. But since then, instead of beetles, snakes and crocodiles are found dead. In 2005, there were 159 alive crocodiles in the Victoria Estuary region, while in 2007, there were only 49 crocs that remained animated. It was their worst mistake. Well, we've seen a crocodile eating a sugarcane frog, but what about a snake? Hey, why didn't I think about this before? This snake decided to hunt a frog in Australia, but sadly it meets the sugarcane toad. Without knowing the type, soon the snake attacks the toad. The toad, like always, just stood there because it knew the poison it contains will do its surviving part. After some time of swallowing up, the snake let go of the toad. So, why did it happen? Unlike crocodiles, the snakes can sometimes taste if it is swallowing poison or if the lunch is unsafe to eat but this happens rarely. Another thing is that the toad's skin is also poisonous just like the glands inside. The frog is like, I dare you to eat me, sucker. With that said, you have reached the end of this video. Now don't forget to fill up the comment section. If you admired our video, then don't forget to press the like button and subscribe to our channel for more hunting and wild videos. See you at the next one.